Hey guys, it's your girl Tracy, and today is Full Lace Wig Day. All right, so as you can see, the front is already done, baby. So if you have not seen my video on how I apply the front, please rewind and go watch that video entitled Full Lace Wig Application. But today, it's all about the sides and the nape. So, if you want to rock your hair up in a high ponytail, then stay tuned. Alright? So, holla back. Okay, guys. I have already prepped my hairline with um, alcohol, of course, and um, skin protected all the way around the perimeter. So, the adhesives that I have is Hollister's, of course. I have some Mr. C's, which is very similar to, I forget the other name, and Endurabond, just for backup. So, what I'm going to do is look and see where I want the side to be. So, this looks about right. Okay. So, then I'm going to apply my Hollister's first. And I'm just going to put it right here. And apply a little more. Then I'm going to let that get tacky. Then I'm going to apply my um, Mr. C's. Alright, so I'll be back. Alright guys, it feels tacky. I have already applied the Mr. C's. So, next we're just going to lay it down. Just like that. And when I do my sides, I like to turn the opposite way to um, kind of stop the pulling, the tugging. Because you don't want to be out somewhere and then somebody's like, trees. You say, ha huh, or ha, huh, and it just pop off. So I like to turn my head to one side. So I'm going to hold this for a while to make sure that it's um, nice and secure. And then I'm going to go to the other side. All right. Like I said before, everybody's body chemistry is different. So, this adhesive may not work for you. And it may work for you. But, just like with hair products and things like that, it's all about trial and error. And what works for you and what don't and also research the adhesive that you are going to use research it okay nice and tacky right now my mr. C's this is another messy adhesive, but it, it works for me. Feels tacky enough. Okay, now let's lay it down. Now the tip of the lace only. Please don't put your hair in this lace purposely. Okay. Now, I'm just going to lay into this side. Okay. So, I'm going to hold it with my head over like that. And then, I'll be back. Okay, guys. So, we have both sides down. Got this side down. Nice and secure. That's the glue. 
that reminds me of Mr. C's. It's secure. That's the name of it. Thought I was going crazy. But anyway. Okay, we got this side down. Nice and secure. Alright. So let's go to the back. Now I'm I'm gonna try to find a position that I can show you all too. So um I'll be back again. Alright guys. Okay, so I'm about to apply my adhesive. Well, first I'm going to position the back to where I want it to be. Okay. Try not to put it in the crease of your neck. So, I'm going to put the adhesive where I want it to be. to do next is just hold it with my head down like this so just like we did the size like this and this so it won't uh, stretch you know if you work at a place where you're doing a lot of bending or you know things like that then it won't pop out so I'm going to continue to hold this with my head down and then I'll be back Alright guys, this is how the back will look after you lay it down. Okay? Like this. Okay? Okay guys, I tied my hair up. 15 minutes, cook my greens, and we are done. Okay, did not take long at all. All right, so let me turn around, try to give you a 360. And you can make the um, bun tighter or looser. I prefer the kind of messy look. You know. But you can do whatever you want to do. And did not take long at all. So, um, that's it. This hair is um, Indian Remy. And, um... The texture is kinky straight. This wig is two years old, just like all the rest of them. I do not have any units that are less than two years old because I have quite a few. So there's no need for me to purchase more unless, you know, I wanted to. But it's really a, not a need for me. So, yeah, this is an old one right here. So do whatever you want. If you want to slick your um, your little hairs down, I prefer to use aloe vera gel. But you do whatever you want to do, and that's it. So if you have any questions, please feel free to hit me up. Other than that, 
You all have a wonderful night, and I hope you enjoyed it. Hope it was helpful in any way. And um, I will talk to you all later. Bye.